Hey guys, welcome to my new Daisy RP series on Affinity RP. It's a server I've been on for about a week now, and my character's name is Dave Earnshaw. I hope you'll enjoy watching me get into mischief and hopefully some great roleplay moments during this series. Thanks. I mean, to be fair, I'm the same thing. I use my Walkman a lot, so I'm usually listening to music. Yeah, and if I'm up here, then the infected can't get to me because, you know, music's really loud. That's true. I recently found a, a basically a playlist of Eminem songs. So I've just been jamming out to them. Eminem? Yeah. Isn't that a candy? Oh my god. Oh. You're missing out. Have you got your. Have you got your radio on now? On you now? Uh huh. Yes, I do. Yeah. How'd you get up there? <laughs> there we go. <laughs> I'm gonna have a rough party. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah. I'll keep an eye out. But uh, yeah, I'll see you around soon. You stay safe, okay? Alright, yep, you too. Oh, and if you see Walter before me, tell him I got some more coffee coffee beans for me. Oh, okay, I will. Okay. See you later. Alright, see you later. Hey, how's it going, man? Hello? Hey, how's it going? Oh damn, you're the you're the UN guys I've been hearing about. Indeed. How's it going? Let me turn this way. Uh not too bad. How about you? I know it could be better. But you know, here we are. What are you doing in this area? The Russians were saying they claimed it. The Russians? Uh, specify which Russian? We've pushed most of the Russian occupations out of this, uh, out of this province. So I don't know what you're on about. Uh, I don't know of them, but, uh... Well... I saw a large group of them yesterday shooting up people. Large group specify white arm burns. It was like nine. So there we go. That's the what the report that we've heard. Every person that I've talked to today has mentioned a large group of Russians wearing white armbands. See, we believe that uh, unknown at the moment still, but uh, we believe that they were the ones responsible for uh, missing control of ours. Shit. Well, I did see him light up the truck. They we were trying to get some guy to answer some questions. He refused to comply so they'll just they basically shut up his truck. Shit. Yeah. Shit that's some good information. So you, you personally seen them light up a truck? Yeah, I was there. I had to lay on the ground. Um, while they were doing it, they were asking us questions and shit. Can you, can you like specify what the truck looked like? Right. Uh, it was green, camouflage, kind of similar to yours to be honest. It wasn't a Humvee though. It was more of like a civilian truck. The civilian truck, it wasn't armored at all? Uh, it, to me it looked armored, but I could be wrong. Alright, alright, got you. Hey Private, make sure that you're fucking uh, writing this shit down. Yeah, I mean it was, it was an American dude in the car. We were talking to him. A bunch of Russians strolled up, told us to get on the ground, and then when the guy in the car refused to answer any questions, he uh, 
he tried to drive away and they all lit the car up, we saw the car smoking as, as he drove off. We don't know if the guy made out alive or not. Interesting. Hmm. That was literally down the road. That was like literally up there near Shifty. So. No shit. Yeah, that's uh, why I was surprised to see you guys here. Yeah, no, no, we were just out doing a routine patrol, so. You'll see a sound about every now and then. No, I mean, it's, it's a good presence to have. It's a lot better than getting shot up. Yeah, definitely, you know. Not everybody's your fucking friend out here, man. There's a lot of cutthroat bandits out here. A lot of fucking scabs trying to take your shit, so. I watch your back. Stay safe. Yeah. Um, Speaking of, is there anything that you're in need of? Anything that I can do to help you, or? I mean, I'm looking for... I'm, I got I've some been, uh, supplies and some rashes in the back. Yeah, I mean, I'm pretty good on on normal supplies, but I have been looking for a specific item. Yeah, what is it? Uh, I've been looking to see if there's any kind of flag anywhere. A flag? Yeah. Like the ones that people, uh, like the ones that a lot of survivors use around the province? Yeah. yeah. To like kind of uh, signify the territory and whatnot. Yeah. Yeah. Um. Let's see what we got back here. Hold up. Give me a second. Thanks for the info, my guy. Now you're good, bro. I, I tend to roam around a lot, so I pick up a lot of information. Like apparently, there's a new group of people moving in in Barrington, load of red armbands. They've been robbing and killing people, apparently. Oh, shit. Really? Yeah. Uh, hey. sorry, what was that? Go ahead. So that guy Honestly, you gave us such good info. We can report, have this. Like, say, like, oh, this guy told us? Oh, wow. Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, what was your name, man? If you don't mind. We're gonna put it down for the report. Uh, it's Dave. Dave Earnshaw. Dave, uh... Hey, can you pull your last name for me? Uh, yeah, it's E-A-R-N, and then S-H-A-W. Alright. Well, here, in return, it in turn, <clears throat> we don't got exactly a flag, but we got a bit of white cloth that, uh, should do the job. You oh my hang god. No, this is perfect, man. I appreciate it. I've been scouting nearby villages for, like, the past two days trying to find something like this. So I appreciate it. Yeah, no that. worries. I mention that. Yeah, I was just. Uh, you need any uh, food rations? I got uh, some MREs in the back. Uh, you know what? I'm good. I picked up some coffee granules, so I'm gonna have a. When I get back to mine, I'm gonna have a nice cup of coffee. Um, I've got some canned meat in my bag and stuff, so I think I'm okay. Alright, yeah, yeah, I'm good. Don't you can appreciate the info? Yeah, I mean, I was just telling your colleague, um, a new group's moved into Barrington. You. The identify with a red armband. Yeah, the last time that we went down there, there was red armbands. Yeah, no, they never met them. They have been apparently like stealing from people. They've claimed a territory up in Barrington. Uh, they've also come over to where I live. They robbed my house. They snuck in through one of the windows I didn't board up, and then uh, they left a red armband in front of my door to signify that they were there. Get this shit private fucking cutthroat bandits, man. More scavs. Yeah, but apparently yeah, I heard... Yeah, no, we've never encountered these red arm bands. Uh, it's quite peculiar. I don't know. We've been to Barrington, I'd say, uh, two or three times. Every time that we've been down there, there's been uh, quite a large group of people, so... Yeah, I mean, I I've just been hearing it from rumors from people I've met on the road, but uh, two guys I met earlier today said they've been robbed by people with red armbands. They said they're claiming a territory in Barrington and if the Russians or the UN go anywhere near them they're going to shoot them on sight. That's what they've been claiming. Yeah, well the way it stands, these people wearing these, uh, these white armbands and the red armbands are just considered another fucking, uh, they're just considered more outlaws and we'll treat them as such, so. Oh yeah, I appreciate that. I mean, you guys are doing, doing a good job. Keep trying to keep everyone safe. I'm definitely on your side. That's what I like to hear. Oh, one more guy. word of warning. They've been going to local settlements. Um, the Russians have 
saying that the settlement's under their protection and all that they need from them is that if they get alerted through the radio if they see any UN now, when you say Russian, do you want to specify the white armbands? Oh, white or? ones. Yeah, white armbands. Right. Yeah, they've been saying uh, if any of the local settlements see any UN presence to radio into them on a certain frequency and uh, alert them that the UN are around so they can try and basically sneak up on you or something, I'm, I'm presuming. Yeah, I've been been to Wolves Pass and the doctor's place just outside of Harmony and I saw the Russians pull in, say that the place is under their protection and then ask for any UN information. So I'll just be careful talking to local settlements, some of them might go behind your back. Yeah, we'll do. We always operate in caution, so... Oh, well, you guys are the professionals. <laughs> yes, sir. Oh. I have a lot of good news, but a lot of bad news. Indeed it is. I said we are to be this info bag. Alright. Well, thank you for the info. No, it's good. I mean, I appreciate what you've done for me. Uh, you guys stay safe. Um, hopefully I'll see you guys again sometime. Yeah, maybe next time we see you, you got some more information for us. And uh, maybe we got a bigger reward for you. I appreciate we'll that. You. I mean, I'm always gaining bits of information here and there. Um, I'm located out of Shifty, so if you're ever going through Shifty, I might be around to give you some info. Alright, good to know. And your name was Dave? I mean, yeah. I probably wrote it down, so we got we got to document it. Brilliant. Appreciate you guys. All right, you guys stay safe, yeah? All right. Take it easy. Take it easy. Thanks for the info. No worries. Hi there. Holy shit, there's one to our left. Sorry, I was... Let's turn this off for a second. I was uh, in my own... I was, I was using my walk, man. I was literally just, uh, my, just in my own little world, though. <laughs> I legitimately mistook you for an infected. <laughs> <laughs> There's so many other systems like which is so still. Then you turned around and looked at him precisely to see if Dick needed You caught me. I, I was, was like, oh, you caught his attention. It's about to. <laughs> I was acting. It's all good. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we were listening to some Billy Joel. That's the shit. Yeah. Yeah. I even got some Smash Mouth. <laughs> it's like when the apocalypse happened, everyone was taking a shit while listening to music. Apparently. <laughs> I mean, a way to go, right? Peacefully just, uh, and satisfyingly. Yeah. If I listen, hey, that's better than a good shit. Out of all ways to go, that's not a bad way to go. It's like... Everyone deciding to be like Elvis. Just to... Isn't some good music? <laughs> <laughs> Dying on the shit. Maybe it was like a movement in this country. <laughs> Possibly <laughs> even the pills involved, too. We found some narcotics. Apparently there's a lot of bangers. Yeah, so basically between Wolves Pass and like Wolves Pass Yeah, so it's like Wolves Pass to Shifty. Between there you get a lot of bandits that roam the main roads. Uh, either in blue or red armbands. So you're kind of like in the, in the thick of it. Yeah, I mean, the thing is I keep my head down and a lot of the groups tend to leave me alone because I deal in information. So, I basically give information to all the groups and in return they don't bother with me. So I've been kind of left alone. Fair enough. Yeah, we haven't uh, come across any problems ourselves. Just some people that are, you know, you say hi to them and they're just like, yeah, and then they walk off. That's, that's about <laughs> as weird as we thought. We, we've gotten a lot of that. <laughs> yeah, well, I mean, I've had a few people like that. I had one guy who refused to talk to me. He literally just went up to me, and every time I asked him a question, he was just like... <laughs> <laughs> well, we got beer at our place. If you ever in the, the mood for it. What the fuck was that? Was that a shop? 
Yeah. That was close. Probably by, the road right? somewhere infected. Towards us, but it was a shot close by. We always get itchy with weapons. Oh! There you go! No way! I always keep one or two on hand. I appreciate it. Once I get back to mine, I'll probably sit down and have this. Of course. I mean, I don't have much on me right now. I, I just, I'm just coming back from my trading run. But uh, do you guys need anything? Oh. Ah, oh, fuck! It's the things? fucking Russians. Oh. oh shit. It's fine. It's fine. Just sit. Just sit. I saw these guys shoot off a guy last time. So. It's all right. 